That back is in dire straits right now. Just making his presence felt there. And he collides into the turnbuckles. He's simply reminding him that he's here. Oh, man. That could break a river, too. Let's touch on Brock Lesnar a bit. We're looking at two individuals who know one another so well. Just what's needed from him here to be victorious. This one's been on the radar for a while. You can bet there was some serious game planning going on. No one can say if we're seeing a once in a lifetime. And he kicks out with a lateral press here. That's because he's not done yet, Michael. Oh, his skull just bounced off the mat. Very curious move to go for a pinfall at this point, right, Ken? Yeah, this guy's got too much energy left in him. And he's driven into the corner. In the pantheon of finishers, Brock Lesnar's F5 has got a rank right near the top. Does it not? Oh, without a doubt. The list of victims that the Beast is subjected to that move is John Cena gets the cover. Look at this. Man, we got a lot of match left. Oh, that's going to hurt. Come on. Now he just wants that insult. John Cena with the cover. John Cena makes the cover. Of all the names on that list of Brock Lesnar's F5 victims, the one that stands out the most to me is Big Show. I mean, we're talking about a seven foot tall, 500 pound giant, and Brock Lesnar picked him up at the 2014 Royal Rumble, walked around the ring with him, and completely destroyed him with the F5. That move at this juncture of the match makes the intention unmistakable to belittle. Trying to humiliate your opponent, there's no place for that here. If he keeps up this pace, this could turn real ugly real fast. Oh, right on the crown of the skull. The F5, Brock Lesnar, and that was a huge counter. He sees it! The WWE audience is all over the world that witnessed the unstoppable force that is looking at it here. I think this is it. And the shoulders up now. That's a kick out. Nice. There's no keeping this guy down tonight. He drops the elbow. At this point, you think he'd have that move well scouted. We got a cover. Oh, he's not done fighting yet. Oh, there is no quit in this man tonight. He's delivering an old-fashioned butt kicking right here. When he gets going like this, there are a few better. Cole, you said it. When the fans in the arenas and watching at home see Brock Lesnar, they know he is the beast incarnate for one reason and one reason only. The WWE superstar whose name is on the dotted line that night to face Brock Lesnar is going to feel pain. I mean, tons. Here's the cover for the win. And somehow he's able to get out. Man, that was close. He simply refuses to stay down. It could be over here. Yeah, maybe. He needs to dig way down deep if he wants to keep going now. Kick the physical punishment that Brock Lesnar brings to the doorstep of his opponent. This could do it. Maybe it. Wow. I can't believe he had the energy to kick out of that. How does he keep doing this? Wow. What a display of heart and determination. He's really zeroing in on the chest now. Yeah, he's going to have a pirate's dream soon. A sunken chest. And no doubt that Brock Lesnar is showing signs of damage. 
Shoulders down. This could be it. Count ref, count. And, and somehow he's able to get out. Man, that was close. What do you have to do to keep this guy down? Boy, he is really tired now. That tank of his has to be reading empty. It has to be, King. But I still don't see him giving up. Extremely impressive win, guys. And when you get a one.